Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're gonna be doing a uh, time-lapse of me putting together the Lego Turbo. Uh, this is the Carrera 930 uh, Turbo. It's, uh, I forget what years it was, but I'm thinking it was like mid 70s, I think 73, 74. But I could be way wrong, I'm not too sure. But uh, coincidentally enough, I'm wearing a shirt that actually has the actual car on it. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put this together on a time lapse for you guys, and uh, go over go over everything at the end of the video. So hope you guys enjoy it.
So here it is, here's the finished result. Uh, pretty happy with everything. One issue or complaint I, I did have was uh, the fitment on the front is pretty shitty if you put the center cap. So uh, I don't know, I might remove the center cap off the rear just to match. But uh, I mean, I like when it looks flush and actually looks like a car that has some sort of style to it. Um, yeah, other than that, I mean, it's great. The roof is really nice, really smooth. Uh, I didn't notice until afterwards that it actually clips into place. Um, the mirrors are a cool little touch. It's got a manual transmission inside of there. Let's see if you guys can see it. And an e-brake right there in the center console. Typical turbo wing. And then it's got the actual turbo you can see inside. Let me turn this real quick for you guys. The turbo down there, bottom left. Radiator on top of the fan. And uh, yeah, got a New York plate on it. So you know it's rusty. A European plate also. It comes with a European front plate as well if you want the front. Um, Porsche uh, logo right there. Turbo logo right there on the, the deck lid, the rear deck lid. The doors are fully functional. Pretty nice door handles too, it's pretty cool. Got your Porsche emblem on the, on the hood. Got your frunk. Typical 911 headlights. And uh, just like every other uh, um, Lego set with the cars, uh, I forget what they're called. Uh, the wheels actually turn with the steering wheel. Pretty cool. Uh, the directions on it were pretty dope, pretty simple. Um, a little bit more difficult than the RSR to understand, but um, the RSR was uh, took a lot longer to put together. This manual is pretty dope too. It has some good information and history on the turbo itself, on the 911 itself as well. Um, if you guys didn't know, you can create a Carrera Targa or you can do a uh, 930 turbo. So uh, it gives you an option to do both. So once you get to a certain point, uh, you use eight and nine bags to create the turbo and eight and 10 bags to create the uh, Targa. So uh, yeah, gives you some options to what you wanna do there. Um, and then throughout the manual, it's got some cool uh, history or historic facts on the 911 or stuff like that. Uh, pretty awesome. As standard, it gives you the whole list set of Legos that you used in the back of your manual. Um, you can also download this on your phone and use that. Uh, but yeah, cool little differences between the two. You've got a soft top on this, on the Targa, and it actually says Targa on the, uh, the uh, rear deck lid right there instead of turbo. So yeah, pretty dope. If you guys have any questions on this product, let me know. Uh, drop it in the comment section below. If you guys enjoyed the time lapse, please give me a thumbs up and uh, I'll be giving you guys some more content later this week. Uh, I'm sorry I've been slacking, but we've moved in to our new spot, which I will give you guys a new video on pretty soon here. And uh, yeah, excited to show you guys where I live. Take it easy. Peace.